Welcome Gamer70k and welcome to part 13 of the Far Cry New Dawn gameplay walkthrough series. Remember to like, share and hit the subscribe button. Let's get into that gameplay. This is going to make things better. We're all grateful. Hello there. You got a real lovely dog. We're in trouble. I think something bad's happened. I'm glad you're back safely, but I can tell you went into the bliss. I tried to warn you. I hope whatever you got from Joseph was worth it. But we have a new problem. It's Rush. He's gone. I, I, I don't know where he is. He said he was going out to do some recon, but he never came back. I've got a bad feeling about this. Please, go search the county for him. I'll watch over the people here. Be careful. You defended us and we needed you most. Thank you.
That was a close one, huh? Oh, we got those fuckers. <laughs> a cab. Okay, back to normal. One thing about the highwaymen. Once they're exposed, they always come back stronger. I've seen it. So, if you ever want to rob a stronghold again, we can. But they'll do everything in their power to make it harder for us. Or there's a new stronghold we can go to. Check, sir. Highwaymen are controlling the only bridge that's still standing over the canyons to the southwest. They wait for people to cross the bridge and then BAM! They do an ambush and take all the stuff. In French, we call that so far fourré. A real greaseball shit. So you wanna know the plan? <laughs> There's no fucking plan, okay? We take from them like they take from the others, and that's it. Merci, bonsoir, Rusty. So you tell me, we go back to the warship, or you and me, la grosse patate, we go to Navajo Bridge? Laquelle tu veux?
lighthouse to the northeast. Go there and I'll extract you. I'll tell you where to meet. Oh wait, go get them, Tiger. Be careful, the package has a GPS tracker. Where it goes, the highwaymen follow. Find chance. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
someone is the Okay, now listen up. There's a lighthouse to the northeast. Go there and I'll extract you. Down there! <laughs> Hey, we. Oui, there you are. Si bon, t'es cool, toi. You got a hard head, rabbit. We told you to stop causing problems. You didn't listen. We got your people. We got Rush. Come down to the old fertilizer plant. Y'all gonna learn more, a lesson. Huh? I like you. Shut up. Please send help. And maybe like a bird. I'm doing my best to contribute around here.
but you and Rush kept making too many problems for us. So finally we had to take things into our own hands. Now it's our turn to make problems for you. Your people here counting on you. We're gonna show them just how much of a curse you really are.
Get me out of here. And I love me a good puzzle. My sleeping husband. Yeah, well, he said I had a pretty good one. So things are looking right for me. I'm on my own here. Just stay positive. I'll die before these fuckers. Just hang in there. We're gonna be... Thanks for saving me. I thought I'd survive this. I'm such an idiot.
you do. It doesn't matter how hard you try. You don't control what happens. We do. Get out of here, now! This feels real familiar. Like we've been down this road before? Oh. Relax. Stay a while. <laughs> Come on. You've been so good up to this point. Look at that. See how easy you can be to get along with? I wanted you to understand that. I wanted you to see that things could have ended differently if you just listened to us and went away. Instead, you chose the stick. Here it is. <laughs> Spend all night wiping those hopes and dreams off my boots. <laughs> oh, you know, before you showed up, everything was fucking great. And then you came along with your fancy train and your fancy people trying to make this place into something that is never gonna be. And when we tried to be reasonable, you thought it'd be a good idea to stir up the pot. Uh, over and over and over. All because you thought there was a hope for your future? There's no hope for you. No future for any of you. Uh. Michelle, Louise, I need you to listen to me. Why? You're not coming with us. I don't have a choice. Your father... Daddy says if you're not with us, you're against us. It's not that simple. Yes, it is. Gotta go, Mom. Dad's here. Michelle, you too 
need to take care of each other. Because your dad, he won't. He has a lot of big plans, but everything he does ends in violence. Dad solves problems. He creates them. He leaves a trail of bodies behind him. He doesn't care who gets hurt. Don't end up like him. Promise me you won't be like him. Shama. All right? I fucking hawked out like that? Everything was normal until they went up north. Maybe it's time we asked them freak some questions. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I got on that train. I'm sorry I brought you to Hope County. We'll always remember you. You took a risk for us, and it cost you your life. This is all my fault. Rush? I promise we'll make you proud. He was a good man. Selfless. And you, you, you did everything you could. Oh, those fucking twins are always a step ahead. We need another angle. I'm gonna go check on Carmina. When you want to hear what I have in mind, come talk to me. What's up, dude? Can we talk? Thanks for your help defending prosperity. We're all shaken up by the loss of Rush, but we can't let up. As much as I hated the idea of talking to Joseph, I have to admit that having New Eden attack the Highwaymen has given us a chance to blindside them. I was talking to the scouts. It seems that out by the old orchards, there's a place the Highwaymen bet on fights. The promoter out there claims to be close to the twins. Who knows if it's true, but it's worth checking out. Thank you guys for tuning in to part 13. I'm out. See you next time on for our new dawn gameplay.